morning guys we are finally back on the trail tasher is getting all healed up he's good enough to get back on the trail so here we are today is july the 14th it is day number 60 for us out here on the trail i can't believe that <laughs> we have actually already we figured up this morning we have already taken 20 zero days because of knee injuries and people not feeling well and then with tasher getting the jardy and stuff so we're going to approach our next week a little bit differently to get everybody back in the back in the groove of uh, hiking. hiking yeah and uh, for so many days our mileage right now is 460 miles with 40 days of hiking so we still have a good average of just over 11 miles a day but um we're, we're ready to improve that so it's time for us to get back on the trail thank you guys for joining us and watching what we do yep letting Tasha kind of lead the way this morning we're moving slow um hasn't been bad but he's he's not uh, he's not really feeling sick but he's definitely tired so just letting him set the pace on how fast we go and that's what we're doing and we'll go until he's ready to stop and we'll rest when he's ready to rest so that's how our day's looking so far guys All right, guys, we are definitely moving faster now. <laughs> we, uh, we're getting this figured out. Tasher, Tasher doesn't feel bad, but, but he's just weak, you know? So many days off with the sickness. So with everything divided up into our packs and his pack now, less than 10 pounds, we're doing good. And now I'm having a hard time keeping up with him. And that's what we want. So happy kids, happy hiking. That's how it is. So the idea today was to get, I think, 10.2 miles, and we're struggling. It's uh, it's noon already, and we've only been two miles, so we still got eight more miles to make it to our destination. But Tasher's doing his best, being a trooper, and we're working on it. So it's going to be a long day if we decide to make it the rest of the 10 miles. But you feel better with your pack being lighter? Yep. Think we can make it another eight miles? Um, try to. We'll try. So that's our plan, guys. Doing what Tasher feels good doing and just keep on hiking. Made it to our lunch spot here. Got a good view and a good breeze up here. Even, even though today's been a struggle, Tasher still made it 3.3 miles. Time for a break, huh, Tash? healthy chips in him <laughs> we're gonna take a break for about 30 45 minutes and then we're gonna get back on the trail and keep trying for that 10 miles found what they call split rock a little bit of a climb up through here that was our last little climb I think for the afternoon we uh, are almost to the shelter maybe maybe another half mile or something and it feels great up here the winds blowing a little bit and Little less mosquitoes. Mosquitoes have been eating me up the last couple hours. But I think our elevation's like 1180 is where we're gonna be camping here tonight. So a little bit of a breeze makes it really nice. And a little bit less humidity. It's been humid and hot all day. So I'm really proud of Tasher for pushing through like he has because 
because we're all tired so i know he's tired but we'll uh we'll get to the shelter and show you guys where we're gonna camp for the night all right guys we made it to the shelter this is the pine something shelter anyways we're still here in connecticut casey's filtering water and we're gonna get our tent set up and call it an evening get us some food cooked and um, get rested up for tomorrow so overall i believe we made it just over eight miles we were hoping for 10 but hey eight miles is awesome tasha really pushed hard today and we're very proud of him so yeah, that worked out really him. good yep so we'll see you guys in a little bit show you what so we got our camp all set up everybody's feeling a lot better the humidity's going away so man that's been really nice but tasha's are right here casey and i are right here and T uh, Tucker is right there. He's got his clothes lined up. So, you know, today was a really good day. Um, like I said, Tasher, at the beginning, you know, we didn't know how today was going to go. We had a goal to do the 10 miles. And uh, we did eight. And so, that you know, that, that's a huge goal for us. You know, we, we had to give ourselves something to go with. But uh, getting eight miles in, you know, was really good for us. So, we're really proud of Tasher. We're going to eat and we're going to get up in the morning and you know we're gonna aim for 10 again we're gonna do whatever we can do you know tomorrow may be yeah may do 15 i don't know but we'll uh we'll see and we're gonna keep going we're ready to cross another state line and get out of connecticut i know that so yep. we're excited to keep moving forward hey guys we're back on the trail today's day 61 um started off kind of slow this morning getting around getting up but uh we made it, we're on the trail. We made it about a mile from camp and uh, saw a really big black bear. So that was really cool. We didn't get any footage of it. But uh, yeah, it was probably bigger than the ones that we've seen yeah, in Pennsylvania and stuff. So that was our first um, Connecticut black bear. Yep, and uh, now we're here. I don't know if the camera's gonna work, but uh, I don't know if you guys can hear that. There's a racetrack right down here that we can see. And oh wait, right there, I think you can see it. So there's some uh, there's some really cool cars down here. So we just stopped here for a few minutes, but uh, it's only 10 o'clock and we've already almost done four miles this morning. We done eight yesterday, so yeah, I think I think we should be able to do 12 to 14 today. But uh, there's a restaurant about three miles ahead. We're gonna go there and get something to eat. Hopefully that kind of boosts everybody's energy a little bit. So mm -hmm. that'll be good. That's where we're headed. good now guys we're back on the trail the trail is actually an asphalt road but we got us all a burger in our belly yep and it was good yes it was and we're back on the trail we got six more miles to go we're gonna try to make it to the post office in the next town over before it closes so yeah, we got we it. six miles to do in what four hours yeah we can do that on our way. Let's go. Check it out. Now that is pretty cool. So Tasha wasn't really feeling that well and we were trying to push hard to get to the post office. Um, I have got about four miles to go to get there before it closes at five o'clock to pick up a package that we have. So the post office is about a mile off the trail. I gotta get there before five, get our packages, and then I'll come back to the trail, meet up with Casey and the boys, and we'll find a place to camp. So. I am trying to get to the post office before it closes. <laughs> Made it to the post office with 15 minutes to spare. All right guys, so Casey and Tasher end up showing up to the post office. Now we're just like laid out here, 
going through our packages and we went to the grocery store and got a cashier sandwich and you're not gonna believe what happened it was sitting on the ground he said i don't want that anymore dad someone to kick rocks up in it i decided to eat the rest of it chomp down yeah completely broke a tooth there was two rocks inside the sandwich maybe one of them was my tooth i don't know but i broke it off so then I had to use Tucker's file from a Swiss Army knife and try to get in there and file it down like a crazy madman. But uh, that's the end of that. That's the end of this video. We're done. We're gonna go find us somewhere to sleep for tonight. Um, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, we're just getting back in the swing of things, but that's it. So check us out on Facebook and Instagram. Like and subscribe, and we will see you guys next time. Thanks, see ya.